blasting through the pre-dawn Florida sky on a SpaceX rocket, the crew of Polaris Dawn. Godspeed, Polaris Dawn crew. May you make history and come home safely. Four commercial astronauts determined to make history. We can see the crew remain with their visors down in the locked position. Late tonight, they will have traveled 870 miles from Earth, the furthest any human has ventured since the Apollo missions. In command, Jared Isaacman, the billionaire entrepreneur paying for his second space trip. Pilot Scott Petit, mission specialist Sarah Gillis, and medical officer Anna Menon. Passing through the Van Allen belts of high radiation, the crew will record their own exposure levels for future SpaceX moon missions. Then on Thursday, wearing brand new spacesuits, the first First commercial astronaut spacewalk, leaving the entire spaceship open to the vacuum of space. Objectively, it would be the riskiest part of the mission. It's also the one that's received rightfully probably the majority of the last two and a half years of attention. And they'll be flying too high to rendezvous with the space station in case of trouble. The mission also part two of a massive fundraiser for St. Jude Children's Hospital. We also believe it is important to address the challenges that we face here on Earth today. This is a continuation of what was started on Inspiration4. They raised over $250 million for St. Jude, and we are continuing that. This is a five-day mission splashing down on day six, probably off the coast of Florida in the Atlantic Ocean, weather permitting. Lester? Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.